Good morning, everybody, and happy Monday. Thank you for tuning into another video. As you can see, finally, not in front of the computer or behind it or whatever you want to say. I just got back from a little weekend trip yesterday and have a, a pretty busy day today. So thought it would be a good day to get out, show you guys what a day in my life looks like. Probably somewhat similar to the day uh, for an average real estate agent. Maybe I do things a little differently. Maybe I do a lot of things the same, but you're going to see today. So stick around. It's going to be a fun video. Just pulled up to the gym now. It's a little before eight o'clock. Usually I like to get here earlier than this, but I have a showing right after this at 930. So I'm going to go in here, try to get about 45 minutes to an hour in, take a quick shower and get to this house. Hopefully I can remember to record most of the things I do today. Regardless, we're going to give it a try. I'm excited for this type of video though. So stay tuned. All right, folks, workout complete. We're showered up, repping the Hallis Home Group gear. About to make a quick drive over to Fayetteville to show a house. Walking up to the house now, guys, what I like to do when I get to homes before the client does, which of course I strive to do, is go inside, make sure everything is turned on for them. That way it's smooth and easy for them to just walk through and check it out. Again, this house is in Fayetteville. Good looking white brick house here. Excited to see what we've got. All right, guys, so once again, just making sure all the lights are turned on, all the blinds are open. In this case, we do not have blinds in here, so something to note for the buyer, and also something that I don't have to do. So, house looks good. It was recently flipped, but that's not what this video is about. I can already hear some kind of noise coming from upstairs. Look at those exposed cabinets. Some people like that, but certainly we'll have to keep your things organized. Got some other cabinets over here though, so at least you got a little bit of both. My voice is so projectile in an empty house. It's kind of, hello! <laughs> Guys, it's okay to have fun on the job, you know what I'm saying? Especially when the clients aren't here yet. It seems like gold is officially back. I feel like I'm seeing gold a lot more now. Nice bathroom though. This flip is basically identical to one that I sold last April. I think it might be the same guy actually. More gold. <laughs> it's definitely back. There's like a million bedrooms upstairs. All four bedrooms are upstairs. And even this house is eerily similar to that one that I sold back in last April. And this guy clearly has a taste because I'm not even kidding. It was so so similar even on the outside uh but we're a city over that one was in peachtree city this one is in fayetteville so that's pretty interesting it's a pretty house so hopefully the buyers will like it touch base with you guys afterwards the noise is coming from this thing and this is probably pretty sad but i'm not even really sure i know what this is sometimes in real estate one showing turns into two that is what happened today Found a house out in Sonoy for these people to look at, and it's a very nice house. We've already gone through and checked it all out. All right, wait till you see the size of this basement. I mean, it is massive. It is absolutely giant. I'm turning the lights off because we are wrapped up here. But this thing is giant. And wait, it just keeps on going. We got a full bathroom in here. I mean, it's huge. Stopped by the house to change clothes. Now I'm at Kroger, about to pick up some groceries. Started a challenge with my girlfriend that will not allow me to eat anything bad at all. So, going to the store to buy some healthy foods and just completely forget that chocolate chip cookies exist. All right guys, so we're wrapped up at the store, heading back to the house now. Need to uh, get on the phone, start trying to reach out to some people. Got a lead for some land, so I need to reach out to them. And I need to contact some attorneys about some closing times for next week. But so far, been a very productive day. Excited to keep it going. All right, guys, back home now. Had to get some things done around the house, but about to get back to work. Gonna make some calls, send some emails, try to get some stuff done. 
record a video and all that good stuff. So we'll see you once that's over with. All right, folks, calls have been made. Emails have been sent. Also just finished recording a video that you will actually see before this one about the top five reasons you should move to Noonan. If you haven't checked it out yet, go look at it. It's live and ready for you to watch. So I think I'm gonna start doing some editing now to these videos and I will record some of it so you can watch. Got the new video processed and ready to go. Hopefully you guys will have seen that by now. Probably about to go get a little bit of reading in before I make dinner. Reading The Seven Habits of Highly Effective People by Stephen R. Covey. It's a tough read, but it is a good read. It's just maybe not the most fun book you've ever read, but heard a lot of great things about this, so I absolutely got to finish it. And of course, Got to read the devotion for the day. It also wouldn't be an honest day in the life if I didn't pretend like I don't usually swing a golf club at least once a day. I like to get at least some range time in, but coming back from a trip yesterday, I wanted to make sure I hit the ground running today. A lot of things to do. So definitely wanted to make sure that I'm as available as can be, but I play a lot of golf. And if you watch this channel, then you probably know that by now. But let's go make some dinner. Before I show you what was on the menu for tonight, here's a quick disclaimer. I do not claim to be a good cook at all. I'm a much better agent than I am a chef. But anyways, here's what we had tonight. Just something simple, just a bowl with some brown rice, some ground turkey and some broccoli with a little bit of teriyaki sauce sprinkled in there. Uh, again, I do not claim to be a good chef, but do try to be somewhat of a healthy eater. And this is a nice and easy meal for me. It's about 7.30 now, so usually at this time, I like to just kind of relax, take it easy. Right now, we've got the NBA playoffs on, so I will definitely probably spend the rest of the night watching that. Before I go to bed, I'll take a look at what things I need to do tomorrow and just kind of get a little list together. But for the most part, that is a day in my life as a real estate agent. I hope you all enjoyed. It was definitely nice to get away from in front of the computers for a video for once. And again, like I said yesterday, you can expect a whole lot more of that in the future. I really do hope you enjoyed it. It was fun to make this one. I think I could see myself doing another video like this one again because there's so many things that I didn't do that I normally would do. So I think we could have a couple volumes of this video. And uh, if you'd want to see that, leave a comment. Let me know. Otherwise, please do subscribe to the channel, guys. It means the world to me. More videos to come. Today's day nine of 100. So 91 to go at least. But I hope you guys do enjoy this. Stick around for the long haul. I appreciate you and I'll see you tomorrow.